All right, the uh, uh, date today is 9th April 2024. Time right now is uh, 2.36 in the morning. This video is going to be just a few random thoughts that I want to share with you. So I don't know if you'd want to watch it, but if you do want to watch and I hope you get something worthwhile because these are the thoughts that I share with uh, the community and uh, some people find them something of value. Normally, I would have made it a Kadak Chai musing. <laughs> Kadak Chai musing. But today I drank so much of Kadak Chai. Man, uh, it's it's uh, you know i need to cut down on the caffeine okay so we can call it a kadak chai musing but um, it's more uh, random thoughts i'll just share with you a couple of things the first thing is um, because i drank too much of tea um, i um, you know you know my lifestyle i i sleep whenever i like i get up whenever i like so sometimes when I feel tired, mentally tired, like the ideas are not coming. I tend to sleep here, you know, this is my video area. I can, I sleep here, I sleep here, watch TV here, my gaming unit is here, my workstation is here, everything is here, you know, and my food is here, snacks are there, and everything is in this room, okay. So when I'm feeling mentally dull, I, my bed is here, I can just lie down, sleep for 20-25 minutes or half an hour, wake up, come back here. Now, the, now that's a good thing. That's a good thing because what happens is if I'm mentally tired, my brain resets. Whenever you have something and uh, your brain feels heavy or you're feeling sluggish or there's too much happening and you can't think clearly, I always suggest take a nap of 5 to 15 minutes. Just Close your eyes, sit in one place. You don't have to force yourself to sleep, just let go. I'll tell you, it, it takes a little bit of practice. But once you get it, when you let go, you'll just knock yourself out. I'll tell you, you, you wouldn't know when you went to sleep. And when you open your eyes, you'll not even realize you went to sleep. And then when you wake up, you're like, oh, sheesh, I actually went to sleep. Because then you can see the time. But then the beauty is when you wake up, your brain resets. And then first it takes time for it to kind of clear its thoughts, to settle down. But then clarity comes. The most important task comes up and uh, you're able to uh, take care of it. Now, the only drawback of doing this is it knocks your rhythm, your natural rhythm out of the window. Like if you sleep on time and get up on time, uh, that completely takes a hit. So what happens is if I tend to sleep, I have, what I've done is I have kind of pushed my sleep pattern for another few more hours. And on top of that, if you have tea or coffee, you can say goodbye to your sleep for another eight hours, nine hours, and this is exactly what happened. Because of this, I, um, where I normally sleep at four o'clock or six o'clock in the morning, four o'clock, say four o'clock in the morning, I ended up not feeling sleepy until I think nine o'clock in the morning. So I predominantly, basically I stayed awake the whole night and I was not feeling sleepy. It's like one side, you know that you're feeling sleepy, but because of the caffeine in your system, you're still like this. Like, you, you know you're sleepy, but you're awake. You, you know that feeling, no? Where you're sleepy, but you drank so much of caffeine, you don't feel sleepy. So I said, no, I have to sleep. I closed my eyes. I tried to sleep. And I woke up at my usual time, which is 12 o'clock in the afternoon. So I just slept for three hours. And I knew for a fact, the minute I woke up, I'm like... Today's day is going to be fucked. It's going to be badly fucked because if I don't sleep, I just can't function. So I woke up with a heavy head, obviously had a shower. Um, I had to collect payments. Uh, some clients had just sent, they wired money. So obviously need to show my face, take the ID card. Came back home. Okay, caffeine by the time hit me and uh, 
you know, I cleaned the cage and everything else. But that is where the problem started. And the problem was, I was not able to function. You know, you have one of those days where uh, you're just sitting down, you want to do some work, but you're just in zombie land. You're just like, you know, you'll just sit down and you'll just scroll through YouTube videos or comments or, you know, you, 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 you're, you're active, but you become like a vegetable. You're just like this. Uh, uh, and I'll tell you, it was so frustrating because I knew I had to make a video. You know, I make my videos when walking outside, but I just couldn't get off my lazy ass to make videos. I was feeling so dead and it's like I sat from three o'clock all the way to 6.30. And I'm thinking, imagine, I'm, I'm sitting here and I'm thinking I need to make a video, but I'm just so distracted. And then on top of that, uh, I had to purchase another device uh, for my review. So there I was busy chatting with the suppliers in China. And then, you know, I put these topics about Sadhguru and Indian politics. Uh, and there people were just busy commenting and commenting and commenting and I just went in La La Land over there. And before you know it, it was already, I think, seven or seven and I was like, man, I will eat something now. I'm not in a mood. Then I went, got the stuff to eat food, came back here. And for me, after I eat food, when I eat food, I watch movies, you know that. So... I eat more than I'm supposed to. And then I feel sleepy again. And lo and behold, after eating food, I was like, oh, now I'm feeling sleepy. I went to sleep. Then I woke up with a heavy head and I was like, man, bloody hell, I have to make my videos, man. That's my daily routine. So I got up and sat down again. Again, I was not able. I'll, I'll tell you, I was feeling so sluggish because I didn't sleep, you know. I, I didn't sleep. I didn't get my proper sleep. And... Uh, once again, I drank that caffeine, that karak chai, which was, I thought it will keep me awake. And then it made me hungry again. I ate again and then I felt sleepy. Seriously, I went to sleep again. And then finally I woke up now. And as, as I was about to sit, I got one client who said he wanted to take my service for a 20-minute session. So fine, we finished that. And only now, only now, after all the struggle of trying to make a video from 12 o'clock in the afternoon, now it is 2 in the night. Ah. Yes. You know, the see, the thing is, I, I don't have to force myself to make these videos. I, I can stay one day without it, but... You know, when you have a routine, when you have a commitment to yourself, when you have an obsession and you say that, no, I have to, I just have to put this video out. It is my duty. I don't have a boss. I don't have a mother, father who will tell me, come on, study, do your thing. And I'm the head of the family. I'm the alpha male. Nobody, nobody orders me. I have to, I run my own life. So you owe it to yourself to have that sense of discipline. Otherwise, you don't feel good about it, man. Because if you hold yourself to high standards, you're like, fuck this, man. I need to do it. And I'll tell you, you'll be surprised to know that, you, you know, if you don't sleep and uh, you can't even think, you can't even fucking think. I opened my document. I had this bloody sheet of paper. You can see it's empty. I had this sheet of paper. I was like, sitting with the paper and I'm trying to think of an idea, a topic and nothing came for hours and hours and every time I kept getting distracted with the messages and YouTube and social media and oh man, it was so bloody frustrating. Have you ever had one of those days where it was just like a mindfuck, you just can't? 
either you're hungry or you're sleepy or you're thirsty or you're feeling drowsy or I was like, come on, man. And finally, I was like, okay, nothing doing. I'm going to make a bloody video and I'll start with this. And that is where a few thoughts started to flow and finally I made a video. I don't know if this has any moral of the story or this has anything worthwhile for you guys, but I would say some of the things that come to my mind is you bloody need to sleep, man. You, you know, especially after you cross a certain age, I think after you cross 40, if you don't fucking sleep, you can't function here. You know, in the younger days, you could, in your 20s, you can work the whole day, go to the gym, and then uh, after eating dinner, you can party the whole night. You don't even have to take a nap, and then you can go uh, eat another, you know, late night Burger King or something, 24 hours, what is open, and then go to work again the following night and have sex with your girl and go to the gym and uh, again go clubbing and uh, go to the nightclub and you can do this for two, three days and still function. And But when you get older, you don't get your proper sleep for, you know, your few hours. Man, bloody hell, it just fucks up everything. Anyway, I just thought I'll share with you. There have been a lot of distractions. So many people joining my WhatsApp group because I put an invite. This time more than, I think, 200 plus people have joined. So there are a lot of comments and a lot of things happening. Uh, then I put these videos about that Sadhguru and Zakir Naik and oh, a tsunami of clients, a tsunami of comments. And uh, yeah, lack of sleep and all that. So anyway, just thought I'd share this with you. I don't know if anything you got anything of value, but if I could give you something of value, after 40, you need to bloody get your sleep. That is one. The second thing of value that I'll give you is you need to stick to your fucking routine. You owe it to yourself to have certain targets and you must achieve those bloody targets. And uh, I think um, there will be days where things are going to get really bloody tough and uh, you need to fight it out here. Yeah. You can't just say, nah, it's okay, I'll leave it for tomorrow. No, you owe it to yourself to fight it out. Anyway, this was supposed to be Kadak Chai Musing. I guess I have drank enough of tea for today. I drank, I think, four, five, six cups. Just drink soda, man. And I hope I can get sleep properly. It's already 2.48. Anyway. You guys take care. If you feel like, comment down below. And uh, have any questions, let me know. Or just share your thoughts, man. Sometimes nice to hear you guys. You guys take care. Good, bad, ugly. Feel free, comment down below. This is me signing off.